Yeah, nice to be here. Uh, it's very glad to be here today to uh, talk about uh, 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 another thing in in, uh, in WordPress. It's about support. We do uh, development, we do testing, then yeah, we do support. So my talk in uh, many is about our our team, my team, uh, WPML support team. Uh, okay, so um, let the a little bit introduction about uh, my company and my share of uh, my company is it uh, on the girl system uh, we have three main products uh, the first one is WPML to help you create a uh, multilingual site in WordPress so anyone here uses oh yeah not too many <laughs> uh, we have two sets help you to uh, create um, advanced cartoon side, but everything in the back end, in WP admin. Uh, the next thing is about, yeah, it's not related to WordPress directly, it's uh, I can localize a translation service. Uh, about me, is, um, I'm working mainly in the support team, WPML support team, uh, I also take part in uh, another activity, other activity in the in the company, for example, community, documentation, something like that. Okay, um, that's enough for introduction, I guess. Uh, okay, uh, I will go ahead to uh, the presentation. The first thing is the, the support, so why, why it must have Actually, there are a lot of a lot of reason to have the spot, but uh, the first thing is that uh, when you when the client buys product, they will take a look very close to how the spot is, how uh, the company, how the team respond their support, their support request. So that's the first thing. The second is that uh, support is also a kind marketing channel. Uh, is our, another name, what about marketing channel? It does mean if you're doing good at support, so the clients, they, they are ready to sell, they are ready to write about how good you are, but, but uh, if you're doing best, so yeah, you also get very negative feedback also. Uh, the, the last years, but I think it's also very, very important is that uh, the spot is a place where you uh, can hear about the client needs, the uh, yeah what the issue they are tr struggling for. Then you have the insight and you can adjust. You add a feature to improve the product. So yeah. So the bottom line with spot, yeah, it's about yeah revenue. It's about profits. When you have good uh, support, so it can influence influence to uh, buy new spirit, and yeah, based on this uh, resource from Sale Frost, uh, it can yeah increasing increase by experience. Okay, so let's uh, yeah we know support is a must have. So when the client come to the spot. What do they expect? Uh, actually, they expect a lot, a lot. They, uh, but uh, I think the, uh, the the basic things. Uh, they want the solution right away. They don't want, you know, uh, in marketing we have a term like A/B testing, and for for bug for issue they don't want A/B testing at all. Um, they want the solution, they want to get the response as fast as possible. And even yeah, even they, they are in the yeah, usually when you have problems you cannot uh, in the good mood. But uh, yeah, but you still expect to have the comfortable environment to talk with the uh, supporter. Yeah, you don't want to get the uh, root course, something like that. And if possible, you you expect uh, the, the the client expect that they can talk in their own language, their native language. Oh, okay, so um, we know why support smart hair. We know what the customer wants. So just 
the next year, our company, our, our team story, so how we get their loyalty. Uh, the first is about uh, DeFi support. Actually, I think there are a lot of definition about it, uh, depend on each team. For example, you can DeFi it to something like uh, you support uh, everything, every problem the client asks for. No matter the problem is related to the products or not. And maybe, maybe you, maybe there are not definition is something like, um, uh, I agree, I will try to give the clients uh, the solution, but uh, if they cannot get it work, so that's ignorance. <laughs> ignorance them. So um, actually, both of them are not good. So sometimes we cannot help the client because yeah, they want something that uh, not included in uh, in the spots. So so what we do, what we need to do is as in RK we need to try to make them happy. We need to try to send the smile to, to the customer. Uh, that's why that's why we in um, in the first day in the first training document for for every new supporter in our team we set this kind of attitude. Uh, every supporter need to know that uh, we need to try to make the customer happy. Then they yeah uh, they they will recommend they brought the twist the rise brought about how good we are. Um, okay, so next, uh, it's about training. Uh, in WPML, we believe that a capable supporter, uh, we believe that uh, training is a good investment. Yeah, because if a supporter is capable, he or she can um, give the support, give the solution quickly, and um, yeah, re reduce the spot time, reduce the waiting time for the client, and yeah, make them more happy. Uh, therefore, we have a lot of, lot of training inside the team. Um, we have the, when the new people, new supporters join the team, they, they don't go to the, the spot right away. They have uh, one month for preparation. They need to know how our team works how uh, approach how to approach for a specific tickets yeah then all the things is done by one by one training that's like around two weeks to one month then we also have a, a training when we release new version uh support we need to go to training to know uh what as new in the new version, what will be fixed and what's a possible issue the client may get with new version. And yeah, and we also have a, a lot of uh, additional training, for example, uh, how to debug for a specific case, how to fix some uh, common issue with our team, as a plugins. Yeah, that's about training. Uh, the next is about organization in the team. Uh, our team is pretty big. It's around uh, 15 to 20 people inside the sport team. So we need to uh, have the, the, the good organization. And this is how we organize the team. We have tier one, just mean a uh, front desk team. This team will take all new tickets. <coughs> then they win give the solution, the possible solution, then if it's a case the issue is too com complicated and they cannot got they cannot get through and the tier to sneer go ahead. But the difference here is that uh, tier one know about the situation, know about the problem, so they prepare the detailed description so Tier two, just go ahead and do more debugging. And um, the last tier, tier three, they 
they kind of uh, the bridge between uh, our supporter and developer. They will go around. They will take a look, and they may escalate to to this the issue to a uh, developer, and even they need to fix for the issue. Uh, so uh, the next is about since we have the team member is distributed are distributed uh, all around the world. So we have ability to extend accessibility to our customer. Uh, our working hour in the sport forum is 24 hours per day. Uh, we almost have no holiday in the team because, yeah, for example, people in the US, in e Europe, they have a holiday, yeah, like the, the, the ending of each year, the biggest holiday, longest holiday. But uh, there is just a normal day in uh, many other parts in Asia or in India or something like that. Yeah. And since we live in many countries, so we most of, yeah, we are uh, bilingual and we even trilingual, so we can support uh, in many languages in their current native language. For example, currently we support in. Um, French, Spanish, uh, Italian, Hebrew, Chinese, yeah, and something more, I, I don't remember. Um, the next is about policy, why why I uh, I say this here, is because sometimes clients, they expect too much, then we need to make the spot policy Clear to them that what we don't, what we what we do, what we don't is support. For example, we uh, of course we need to support for everything, every feature that we offer to the the, the customer. But uh, we cannot support the thing like uh, cutting works. Uh, our team do not provide cutting works uh, or something like server configuration. Yeah, we don't. That's not included in in our plugin support. So yeah, we need to make that clear to the client. And yeah, if not, they will be easy to get access. Um, yes, yeah, when but in, in the case we cannot help the client, we also try to give them some hard solution. For example, in this case, we have a list of certified partner that they can come to this partner and yeah, they ask for work. Yeah, of course, need to pay more money. Um, yeah, in our team, we also use a lot of uh, indicator, in a lot of statistics to uh, know ways uh, why something does not work. Uh, we have collect the information for each for the whole team, for each individual, each team member, and even each kit we're working on. Uh, here is some uh, indicator. Yeah, we have great team. People, uh, the customer rate great, good, not so good. They can uh, write the detailed feedback and yeah, another many other like new tickets per month per day, every time to resolve. Um, with these uh, statistics info, we when the problem happens, for example, yeah, the queue going go high in some days, so we need to know we, we can know that's where it's from. For example, sometimes it's from uh, our a procedure we change the process, pro procedure and it slow down our process. Uh, sometimes it's from um, yeah, for example. Uh, our, our, our new release having some critical bugs. Yeah, we can figure out where the problem the problem is from, and we also use it to optimize our support activities. Um, yeah, the next thing is about the self help. Uh, because we we think that uh, if the the customer can find the solution by themselves. That's much better and that's much faster for them. And that also means we can reduce the support lot. So we can have a lot of self-help. Uh, yeah, the first is documentation. 
Uh, yeah, it's about how to use this, how to set up by step by step. I think every um, team, every plugin having this. Uh, another thing is about Erata. Erata is a place where we list all known issues. That's the, uh, yeah. So with this information, the client, the customer can go through the list and know that's the a specific issue is known or not, the, our developer aware about this or not, then sometimes, many times, yeah, actually, uh, many times we provide the workarounds, then the, the customer can uh, still uh, working on, can still work on their projects with uh, our workaround before we release seeing the, the new version with the fix, something like that. And we have something I think this a bit different from many other teams that we have resource summaries that um, that is uh, when a, a ticket is getting resource, new a supporter with uh, write in detail something uh, the information like um, what the issue is, how to replicate is the issue, and the the solution. So that makes a lot of sense in the case that because um, when the client they they open a new ticket, they rise and they, we we go through our database with resource summaries. We display the possible related tickets with the solution. Yeah, then they will get the the, the solution right away and stop writing. Uh, the last one is about um, our, our support channel. We use uh, for room, and we uh, we make it public. That means um, best customer they can create new request, new tickets about uh, the problem they have. But uh, everyone can see um, the 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 conversation between supporter and other. Clients. Okay, so yeah, that's all what we uh, we do, and at the end of the day, the client happy, and yeah, we also happy. <laughs> okay, so uh, everything yeah is still going very very well, but uh, that does not mean we stop and. Do nothing more. We have a lot of lot of idea to improve. Uh, yes, for example, here is the uh, the idea. Some some of them we are just in the idea and we we implement in the future. But some of them we are doing it. Uh, for example, better documentation. We um, we may try to use wiki format. It's called we uh, one. Uh, the supporter documentation team and even uh, client can contribute to the, our documentation. So wiki format is a, the better tool for, for this purpose. Uh, we also, the next one is automatic ticket assignment. This is, uh, we are implementing this. Uh, this is something um, like uh, before, uh, uh, Supporter need to take tickets by themselves, but now we use uh, some algorithm to uh, calculate the, the support space, can, uh, calculate the supporter working time, yeah, holiday, vacation days, and the work, uh, the support lot. Then we allocate the tickets to the supporter, yeah. Uh, yeah, the next thing is about uh, document suggestion. Currently, when the client open, uh, opens new tickets, we display only uh, the, the related resource tickets with summaries, but in the future, we are thinking about display documentation also. And uh, the, the last one here is about, since uh, our team is pretty big, so we divide team into the small group using P2, P2 team, so yeah. 
So everyone from uh, from other time zone when they work, they can see, uh, and whenever they have ideas, they can write there. So everyone can get up this, can know about that, and we make a solution uh, faster. And uh, yeah, we still keep Skype for the whole team. Yeah. Okay, so uh, that's all for my presentation. So uh, yeah, discussion. Do you have anything to discuss, to uh, contribute, to, yeah, please. So we have, still have five minutes. <laughs> All right, uh, we will proceed then. Uh, thanks, Lajuan. Yeah.